alternate interior angles, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, when you're doing, when you're looking at alternate interior angles, um, what we're going to do for that one is again determine the angles that are interior of your two lines. They could be parallel or not parallel, but they're going to be interior of these two lines, and they're going to alternate the line that intersects them, which we call the Jordan. The starts with the T, ends with the Sol. Transversal. Very good. Okay. So yeah, whatever, something like that. All right. So anyways, we have angle of three, and Jordan, what, what would you say is alternate interior to angle three? What would you guess? Is three? Yep. Uh, it's in both inside the parallel line, inside the lines, and it's on one. It's on the other side. Very good. Angle six, and then you could also say angle five and angle four. And those are your two examples of alternate interior angles. You guys have to know these definitions.